In this video, we're walking through how to use playlist templates in ProPresenter to set up your services faster and keep your workflow organized. If your service has roughly the same structure week to week, for example, welcome, worship, announcements, sermon, then playlist templates are for you. They can save you time and make sure your service planning can be as seamless as possible each week. ProPresenter allows you to create custom playlist templates that use headers and placeholders so your structure stays consistent, while allowing you to add new content quickly and easily. Let's jump in. Inside ProPresenter, click the plus sign next to Library and select New Playlist. Let's call this one Sunday AM Service. Now, we're going to add the structure of a typical church service. Think about what parts of your service rarely change and what parts do. For the parts that rarely change, create headers for each segment. You do this by hitting the plus sign in the detail view and selecting new header. Click on it to rename it for your segments. For example, let's call this one pre-service. You can even add custom colors by right-clicking on the header and selecting change color. Anything that changes regularly, like songs or message slides, should be added as placeholders. You can add a placeholder by clicking the plus icon and choosing new placeholder. Then give it a generic name. Since this first header is for your pre-service, we can label this placeholder Announcements. Repeat this process for all of your segments. Add a header, customize it, then add placeholders under the header that makes sense for that part of your service. Once complete, right-click on the playlist name and select Save as Playlist Template and name it. From here, you can either fill in the playlist with your content or delete it. Now, let's use this template to create a new service. Instead of starting a new playlist from scratch, click the plus icon and choose New Playlist from Template. Select your Sunday AM service template and ProPresenter will make an exact copy. Rename this playlist. Most folks use the date of the service. Now, you'll see your structure already in place. Announcements, worship songs, host spots, sermon, and so on. Next, add your content. Start by replacing your worship song placeholders. You can search within ProPresenter, or import new ones from your computer, song select by CCLI, multi-tracks, or planning center. Pro tip, if you regularly add new songs, it's a good idea to save them into a separate worship songs library. That way, they're easy to drag in each time you're ready to build a service. After the songs, link your host and preaching slides. For preaching slides, you can import an existing presentation sent to you from your preacher, or you can create a new presentation, add your sermon title, points in scripture, and drop it into your playlist. If there's a section you don't need that week, simply delete it. Templates give you a starting point, but you can always trim what's not needed. Now, anytime you start a new week, you can build your entire service in minutes by using new playlist from template. And that's it. Using a playlist template saves tons of time and keeps every service consistent and polished. If you found this helpful, drop a comment below. And as always, thanks for watching.